In the reading on fixed income valuation, practice problem 31 in the curriculum asks you to calculate the discount margin on a floating rate note. The curriculum gives you an explanation for that question which is extremely long-winded. What I'll do in this brief video is give you a much shorter way of answering a question such as this one. Let's read this together. You are evaluating a three-year floating rate note which pays six-month Kaibo plus 200 basis points. This tells us immediately that the payment is semi-annual, three-year floating rate note. So that means we have six semi-annual periods. 200 basis points, this is the quoted margin. This security is priced at 95 per 100 pa. So 95 is the current price. Current six-month Kaibor is 10%. Kaibor is the Karachi interbank offer rate. It is effectively like LIBOR. This is our reference rate. Assume a 30, 360-day count convention and even the spaced periods. What is the discount margin? These are just standard assumptions that we are making for the valuation of floating rate notes. I'll walk you through a straightforward four-step process to come up with the discount margin. Step one is to recognize the timeline, and we've already started doing that. At time zero, the price is minus 95, and we have six semi-annual periods. Step two is figuring out the coupon payment. Assuming that Kaibo remains at 10%, and that also is a simplifying assumption that we make in this reading, so Kaibor is 10%, the quoted margin is 200 basis points, which is 2%. So the overall annual rate is 12%, but this is a semi-annual security. So per period, the payment is 6% of 100. That's what gives us 6. So the payment is 6, 6, all the way through till the end of year 3. And then the par value of 100 is returned. Step 3 is computing the discount rate such that the present value of all these cash flows equals 95. And here, rather than use the long-winded method given in the curriculum, you should use the calculator. Note that N is 6 because we have 6 periods. PV is minus 95. That's the price of the bond at time 0. Payment is 6. That's the coupon payment. Future value is 100. You compute the interest rate and you will get 7.05%. This is the rate for one six-month period. Double that to get the annual number, and you will get 14.10%. Step four, then, is to come up with the discount margin. The discount margin is simply the difference between this rate, 14.10, and Kaibo. So the discount margin is 4.1% in basis points. That is 410 basis points. Hopefully that made sense. Now use the same method to solve practice problem number 31.